the, the characters you've sat at a couple of the press conferences they're, they're not saying an awful lot to each other but it does feel to me like better be have said a couple of things just thrown a couple of things out there but Bivol's not not nibbling at the launch press conference he said something like he knows ask him when they did a face-off at uh, Fury and Garnu uh, around the media he said Bivol always talks about he wants to fight but he never fights Bivol never bites he's never said anything what, what are you making of the kind of verbals or lack of verbals between them yeah, I think I mean at the first presser better be have said about three words and it was like I actually said you know I'm sure you'll bring it up this week I found it quite arrogant because you're flying him over and his team you've got I think it was you or Addy asked him the question you know and he just went good and it's like hang on a minute you, you know you're getting paid an absolute fortune you've got the entire world media here you owe us a little bit more than that. He couldn't care less. Like, and in a way, I respect it, but in a way, I think it's a little bit disrespectful. I'm not expecting him to come and start rolling around with Bivol here tonight, but you are a monster. You've got your role to play in this fight. You're receiving a huge amount of money. Let's play the game a little bit. But when you actually get into Better Be Ever and break him down a little bit in the interviews, he is actually quite funny. Mm. And he's got this like very cold, dry sense of humour that actually does come out and he should show that a little bit more because I actually think he's quite a funny guy but he's not he's not interested you know and that's actually why both of these guys maybe their profile isn't what it should or could be given their ability in the ring but they're just searching for greatness and that's actually all that matters to them and it is a little bit refreshing in some sense you know but in answer to your question don't say that at the presser in front of Arthur Betterbeev you know, just oh, about the about the you called him arrogant, yeah. Eddie. You called him arrogant. I'd say absolutely never said it in my life. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, Eddie. Thank you. We're going to let you go for now. I'm sure we'll speak to you thank multiple you. times this week. And uh, yeah, if you just please okay, leave like and, that, and go it? and call okay. Better Be of Arrogant again. <laughs>